the data engineer and data analyst the most demanding skill for the last decade and it's going to continue in this decade as well and it is not only uh, demanding it is well paid job as well if you want to be a data engineer or data analyst you are working in some other industry you want to transition it or if you are a student or fresher you want to be start your career in this domain and you don't know what skills or tools required why those skills are required and what to start we are going to demonstrate in this video welcome to analytics with max let's start with the salary because Uh, you, you should know what salary you're going to get in this field so if you are from india and a data analyst for entry level will uh, get somewhere around 3 lakhs to 10 lakhs and a senior member most probably they will become a team leader they will get around 8 lakhs to 25 lakhs it comes to a data engineer 4 lakhs to 20 lakhs in a junior role and 10 lakhs to 20, 35 lakhs this is the salary range there can be some outliers like someone who gets 50 60 lakhs in a senior role either in data engineer or um, in data analyst somewhere they will get 30 40 lakhs that is outliers we are not talking about the outliers we are talking about the average income and you can see in the united states it is 50 to 120k for data analyst junior role and 90k to 170k in the senior team lead role and data engineers will get 60 to 140 and senior 120 to 200k so this is the uh, salary range of um, data engineer and data analyst by that this time you might have decided you should become a data engineer but my personal preference is data analyst let me try to answer this at the end of this video so i use this website to get this data that is glassdoor payscale and you can use this uh, job search site like indeed naukri linkedin this will be really helpful while you are searching for the job let's try to start with what skills and tools required to become a data analyst first important skill is sql or database dbms it can be any sql you can use microsoft sql or oracle or pl sql or mysql whatever it can be sql is the base next skill set reporting tool i prefer power bi that is why i mentioned it if you are using tableau click view anything is fine but you should have any reporting tool modeling skills basically it's all about how you design the tables star schema uh, fact dimensions you create measures all this comes with the modeling skill then greater visualization basically um, it is all about uh, storytelling uh, you need to use uh, right visuals to get um, right answers right you need to project uh, use cases in a proper way you need to know appropriate visuals so these are the skill set required to become a data analyst let's try to check it out what are the skills required for a data engineer sql again sql yes of course sql is universal and big data technologies basically you need to understand about different types of data structured unstructured semi structured and streaming all other kinds of st stuffs based on the different types of data you need to uh, know about it and what tools to handle those types of data and the storage like uh, adls hadoop distributed file systems big data all other technologies then data bricks as pack it's a cluster processing to process all your big data load to handle your big data load you need some clusters of course you need to know a python uh, a programming language that is um, used to handle a um, lot of uh, data wrangling and um, 
you you need to do lot of other stuffs in the notebooks uh, if you are using databricks so you should know python the mandatory for a data engineer is to have some etl tool it can be data factory or any other tool it, mostly i'm talking about the microsoft uh, related stuffs if you are in um, familiar with amazon the glue uh, amazon glue is a etl tool and all other stuffs are uh, similar i mean the same uh, open source technologies you can use in amazon as well so these are the skill set and we have talked about uh, both the skill set let's try to understand why those skills are required right see i told uh, some skills for data analyst and some skills for uh, data engineer why those skills in order to understand why those skills and uh, what role they play we need to understand the entire architecture of data warehouse basically we have a data in uh, different sources it can be um, different varieties as well so uh, we cannot generate a reports on that on top of uh, these systems because you need to report from different places so you need to have a common place you will bring all your data this job is done by data factory any other etl tool generally so you will store it somewhere and then you will do the modeling and reporting this is the typical architecture so where does these two roles play basically data engineer works completes over here and data analyst works over here so it is not a thumb rule all the data engineers do only this and data analyst will do only this sometimes data engineer also create a power bi report this data analyst also work on small small uh, data engineering activities as well it purely depends upon the organization you work on but this is the general rule and it is not always the architecture whatever we showed uh, it will be followed everywhere let's say like instead of um, uh, the cloud technologies your source system everything in sql then people also go just simply like uh, in database as well instead of storing in big data or hadoop distributed file system or adls they just use the database as well in this um, uh, approach data engineer works are very minimal the data analyst or whoever has a basic understanding about uh, data factory they can able to achieve their end objective so from here you don't need to use ssas you i mean uh, analyst service you can directly connect to power bi this is the minimalist architecture of your data analytics so then where does the data engineer uh, play a major role let's assume you have a complex architecture like this where you have your data needs to be ingested and you need to maintain different uh, layers this is called a medallion architecture and where you maintain your data in a bronze silver gold uh, this is not a um, uh, session for to explain this so this is pretty much a complex architecture that requires um, big data uh, uh, processing uh, technologies and this is where the data engineers play a major role over here they will design how this data should be transition into different areas on incremental basis and they will configure this clusters and they will provision uh, all the uh, tools required for the data scientist and they will monitor this let's assume that your organization has 100 plus pipelines and uh, you have uh, multiple sources of data let's assume 50 sources of data you need to ingest and monitor it you need different monitoring tools as well so here the data engineers roles are very crucial and they need to understand different technologies and tools so this is what uh, data engineer do and data analyst as usual they will generate the reports from once the data is available for them so i hope uh, now you understand uh, why those skills and uh, tools are required where to study a 
of course if you are looking for um, data analyst congratulations you have everything you have got in analytics with youtube channel where you can learn sql and power bi and visualizations all together in uh, in the channel and if you are a data engineer work in progress it is not complete i cannot say all the tools that we have just now seen is available in this channel and of course which has almost a 50 percentage of uh, content you can kick start with so this is all about uh, where you can uh, start this channel also contains um, power bi msbi and fundamentals of azure you can utilize this free content share this channel with so apart from this is there any other sources i will leave it to you guys where to study like you can recommend in the comments if you have personally benefited from those channels or any other uh, websites that you prefer to share with the community please comment below that will be helpful for many students or aspiring data analysts or data engineers so key takeaway from this uh, video is like sql is universal you need to know multiple skills and tools and data engineers have more skills required than data analyst this is why i told in the first slide of my video like i prefer data analyst which is easier to start with if you are starting your career compared to data engineer because if you have seen the architecture earlier how complex it is in you deal with you need to learn lot of technologies lot of tools and it the learning curve is uh, very long whereas in compared to the data analyst that is what my preference is it is up to individual's decision you are free to decide whatever path you want to choose and do remember that data is asset if you like this video hit the thumbs up button and comment below for queries